welcome to off the menu i am the queen and as always it's an absolute blessing and an honor to be bringing you musical and conversational excellence so now before i got on radar i used to be really really irritated by djs that would like you know cut a song and then like oh time check it's now one o'clock and now i'm that person so <laughs> sorry guys if you're enjoying something so weather but you're joining us today um for a very special um segment that we've carved out because these queens with me in studio got something important that not only you need to hear about but um, need to know about and amplify and that is the harare writers open mic joining me in studio are queens tawanda mudonga and queen eleni atitaki welcome to off the menu queen thank you queen hey. so you guys are nice and bubbly and everything how has the start of 2020 been for you guys very interesting okay lots going on exciting yeah. newness new projects yeah it's been good it is. Yeah. It is a new queen already? Um, yeah, very good. Um, new beginnings, uh, new things happening, yep. fresh things in the air. Um, we've always complained about wanting to go out and not knowing where to go out. Yes. Same time, you don't want also too much of a din din din. Mm. Um, and yeah, we were blessed and we found our spots. And yeah, yeah we're working to make that something that everybody can oh, enjoy yeah. with us. Sure, and before we get into that, I think, I mean, I did a bit of snooping. Um, in terms of your stories, both of yours and, and, and your backgrounds and sort of the stuff that you've been involved in, I just wanted to say thank you because a lot of the time when you're either pioneering something or you're part of something bigger than yourself, you're always just working and working and working and working. Yeah. But if you look at um, the conversations and the spaces that you guys have influenced and contributed to, it's a lot with what we've done with our hair Zimbabwe, how you? Come on guys, so, like, like, let's give you a round of applause. <laughs> So Queen Tawanda, we'll start with you. Talk to us about Harare Writers Open Mic. What's, what is that? Okay, um, so the Harare Writers Open Mic, uh, it's a new platform that we are launching at the Elephant and Pineapple. So it's a series for writers, poets, to be on stage and for the lovers of poetry and good writing to come and sit and listen. Um, but it's not only uh, readings and performances, it's workshops and mentoring for young writers. We just wanted to create a space on the stage for mm -hmm. literary artists, uh, basically. And um, this time is going to be at the Elephant and Pineapple, mm -hmm. uh, the new venue that's just opened. Mm -hmm. And uh, so, yeah, we're just asking people to come out for good food, mm -hmm. good readings, good uh, literary work, and, uh, and a beautiful garden. Yes. Yeah. So, mm -hmm. Queen Eleni, you're now the new owner of Elephant um, and Pineapple. So talk to us, what can people expect when they when they come there, whether it's food and experiences? So one thing that we can guarantee you is an exclusive intimate environment. Mm -hmm. uh, it's on purpose that we don't have lots of seats. We okay. want to keep it um, simple. We want to keep it clean. We want to mm -hmm. be able to run it ourselves. Right. Um, don't be surprised. You're going to be seeing me serving all your food when you come through. Right. Um, that is a choice. Um, it's my way to make sure that the customer is satisfied. Mm. Um, the other thing we're aiming on doing that I think it's the first of its ty um, type, I might be wrong, is have a up close and personal experience with the actual artist. Yeah. So the artists, as I said, we are very limited. We all in all have just under 15 tables. Yeah, okay. So the artist does engage with you personally. Mm. It's not loud, overcrowded music. Sure. Um, so, um, yeah, with, between the unique experience with the artist to actually get to know him and the artist to know you, yeah. also comes very good food um i always do my shopping first thing in the morning so everything is fresh whatever it hasn't been sold we take home and we eat it <laughs> um and the other thing i'd like to point out is that our prices are also quite reasonable yep. you won't come and have lunch and then not be able to afford to fill up your full tank <laughs> when you find a short queue <laughs> <laughs> and comedy you into comedy as well <laughs> <laughs> i'm not <laughs> Long John was um, yes, because yeah. you, you did you did have Long John, and I think um, what's important as well, Marcus. The thing is, we're looking at how we're telling different stories, um, and also how are we part of the story. Are there yeah. not enough pla uh, places where you've got that level of engagement to be able to understand? Because a lot of the time we go to a place, whether it's a performance or a recital, and you've got a lot of questions afterwards, and it's not the same. Not trying to DM a person. You want to be in that moment and, exactly. and capture that. So I think that's really really exciting. So now we are um, 
a very young station, um, very progressive, very, you know, cognizant of the fact that this platform that we have is to share alternative stories. What stories would you like to hear more of? I think that everyone has a story, to be honest with you. I, I can't say that I haven't... I feel like I meet so many people and we, if we find the moment or the time to like actually connect, right. everyone's story is really interesting. It just depends on whether you are able to translate that story. Yeah, so for some yeah. people, they translate through music or through painting That's or true. some people have the gift of being able to write in words. I'm a writer and you know, mm -hmm. I'm really passionate about telling Zimbabwean stories, whatever they may look like. You know, Zimbabweans right. are not just one thing. They're not just men, they're not just women, young, old. Everyone has a perspective. Mm. Um, so I think uh, with the Harry Rice's open mic, we just want to create a platform. So, you know, right. if you have a story, come and tell us about it. Whatever it is, come share. It's intimate, right. it's personal, you know, to also give uh, uh, young writers confidence to be yeah, on the stage. Yeah, that's um, true. So, it's just been missing in the art scene, and yes. Batsurai Chikama, who's yeah. kind of like the brainchild behind mm -hmm. this, you know, she's a NAMA award winner. Yep. Uh, last year she um, was at the Iowa Writers' Workshop, she's mm -hmm. a fellow there in America, mm -hmm. so, uh, and her book, and the Children. Um, we, she came up with this idea of this platform, so she's okay. going to be performing tonight alongside Charity Utete and mm -hmm. Rutsukota. Wow. Yeah. So now for those that want to share, is there like a database? How do how do people sign up? How do we sign up if if, if we want to come and share our stories? Um, I think on Facebook, if you go to yeah. our Facebook page, there's actually uh, um, an event, the Harry Writers Open Mic. Okay. Um, send a message there. Put a comment. Um, I'll when we leave the studio now, I'll upload information on how to get in contact. Sure, okay. love that. And Queen <coughs> Lenny, where is Elephant and Pineapple for those who have no idea? Where we it is. are at Newlands, 15 York Avenue, corner Victoria Drive, um, just behind the shops, very close to and the shops. And TM, TM, yes, yes. Oh, fantastic. And what time is it today? And is there is there a cover charge? So it starts just after six um, o'clock. Okay. Thank you for asking about the cover charge. That has been a small issue that's has come to our ears. Um, so. I don't know, this might sound a bit funny, but um, we need to clarify, um, we don't date sugar daddies, uh, we're not children of <laughs> rich daddies, <laughs> we do this ourselves, by ourselves, um, because I've been also involved in the arts with my husband, with several friends and everything, for us it's very important that the artist doesn't only get exposure. Mm. Um, I can't have three magnificent women in my garden today and send them a hundred RTJs on EcoCash yeah. because that was it. So, and because we've got limit, limited seating, mm. that's why we have a cover charge on all our shows, but the cover charge is fully redeemable. Mm -hmm. So whatever your cover charge, you'll get it equivalent. You can either choose to have a nice bottle of wine, a cheese platter, a three course uh, meal, your drinks. The uh, authors the are going to have right. their books for sale. Sure. When there's a musician, they'll also have their CDs for sale. Right. That is just our way to guarantee that both the artist and mm. our venue at least gets yep. something out of it or while offering a unique experience mm. for the crowd Special that's attending. Yeah. Sure, I love that. Um, we've got somebody that's joining us, well, a couple of people. Um, shout out to you, King Kuzai Choms Kartel from Czech Republic is watching. Thank you for joining us, King. Mm -hmm. So time check is now 27 minutes past 12 o'clock, getting ready for um, the People's Book Club. So Queens, you cannot come on the radio, and especially my show, and not give Erin a shout out. Who would you like to give a special shout out to this, this afternoon? Um, I guess I'll give a shout out to my daughter, Mufaro, mm -hmm. the most beautiful girl in the world, yeah. the most special person in my life. Yeah. I love you and I miss you. Oh, <laughs> Queen of Lane. Um, yeah, my baby girl as well. <laughs> my baby girl and my husband that deals with me all the time as well. <laughs> and I'm sure there's some friends that are watching over from Greece and my sister from Cape Town. So, yes, all my love to everybody that's hearing us. Fantastic. Thank you so much. So, guys, you heard it for yourself today. Edmonton Pineapple just after 6 o'clock. Uh, 15 York Avenue. Do not ask me for directions. We'll get there tomorrow. So, coming up next, we've got the People's Book Club. And please, thank you so much thank you. Uh, for joining us, as well as everybody that shall watch the rebroadcast. So, we do not take um, for granted the fact that you guys use your time and your resources to watch us. You could be doing anything else. But here you are. So we really appreciate that. Queens, thank you so much and all the best for today. Thank you, Angel. Thank, thank you. Thank you.
Hey, you listening to Hot and Soul Radio Station? Station? Station?